Yo, 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 what's up, world? Hey, yo, it's your man, I Hero Kirk. I'm out here filling in for Cam Low. I told him don't even come in. It's a holiday weekend. Take the day off. That's right. Who's next? 757. We out here. I'm sitting next to nobody but Hampton's own Fat Trey. My man in the building. What's Fat Trey, what up? What's up? How you feeling, B? I'm good, I'm good. Hey, look, we blessed That's to have you. We're going to get right into it. So um, tell us about your background. Coming from Hampton, what was that like? Coming from Hampton, man, it was like, it was rough because I was bouncing from like house to house. So it was like being with my mom and then my dad not being there, I had to grow up real young. So I had to wow. grow up as a man by myself. So it felt, I felt like I did a good job. I graduated. So yeah. You say graduate? Graduated what? High school? College. What? You got a degree? No, you a musician with a degree? Yes, HBCU, I see you. Okay, so you you went to Norfolk State. Yes, sir. So what was that like transitioning Norfolk State, college student, and doing this music thing? Well, at first I didn't want to go to school. Mm -hmm. I didn't have a direction, so I was just like, I'm going to just try it out. Because I ain't trying to be home. She was like, oh, I'm going to be tripping. She was like, oh, you got to get a job. Mm -hmm. So I said, I'm going to go to school, find something I want to do. So I chose my major as mass communication. I did that, and that's like, that's what connected me to this music stuff. So. I just feel like that really gave me a direction of what I wanted to do. Okay, okay. So, uh, and so, at what point did you decide? You know, this is it for me. This is where I'm gonna go. And you know, what what was it that 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 struck that light bulb for you to why I'm going with music? Because there's a lot of things you could have done with mass comms. There's a lot of things you could do with entertainment. Why did you want to become an artist? Um, I just I love music genuinely. Mm -hmm. I love the, I like writing music. I like being in the booth, just hearing the beat played by itself, and thinking of all different type of ideas and stuff like that. I always loved like R&B, so like R&B was always the lane I want, always wanted to go into. Mm -hmm. I feel like everybody's trying to rap nowadays and everybody got like the same sound, so I just want to bring a different sound, especially from being from VA. Mm -hmm. I feel like we got a different sound anyway, but they don't give us that much credit. Okay, okay. So tell us about your project. Um, tell us about your first release and some of the things you've done already. All right, my, my newest project is called Toxic Love. It was during the time I was going through something with a, with a girl that I really like. I really fought with her heavy, but it's like, she really kept playing games. It's like, we was in a relationship for like two years. She's like a tug of war. Yeah, she it's like, she wanted to be in or out. Or I mean, I mean we, was, we was going strong, but it's like, she was playing on my mind. I felt like, I felt like it was just dragging me both ways. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, it's like, she, we was there. I was there, but then I mentally left, like, the relationship, like, a couple months ago, like, it just drained me, so I wrote a song called Toxic Love. That's like the first song on my project. Gotcha, gotcha, and gotcha. And it goes over all those details. Y'all can go get that. Apple Music, Spotify, YouTube, all that. Go get that. Ooh, Toxic awesome. Love. Awesome. awesome. So, so um, what do you think has been the uh, toughest thing for you embracing this music thing? What's been the hardest thing? Just promote myself. Okay. By myself. Okay. Without a team, like, around me. So you're an army of one. Yeah. But you've made some noise by yourself. I mean, you got a lot of streams. I see cats that come through here a lot. You know, shout out to Cam Lowe once again. He do a Cam lot. Low. And I've seen cats with, like, two streams. Nice. And you got a few more than two streams. So, you know, that says a lot. That's that's natural love from mm -hmm. my city, though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's natural. Okay. So you were popular in the city before music? Yeah, definitely. So what'd you do before music? Were you in the sports? Yeah, I played the sports. Okay. You look, you, you look kind of like a like a like a football guy. What's your football dude? Yeah. You play basketball too? I play both. Okay, you got I play, I play rugby. I play everything. Rugby? Oh, yeah. you're a real athlete. Yeah, real. I don't know too many brothers playing rugby. Yeah. That's some different stuff. But you get real rough with people in rugby. Right. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, um, music. What's in store for you going forward? What's in the future? What do you what do you see yourself a year from now? If everything worked out perfect. Where do you see yourself? Are you independent? I'm or are you road. or are you signed to a major? What do you think? I'm independent right now, but I'm trying to go on the road. I'm trying to. Take the next level to where I gotta go. It's okay. time. Okay, so if a label came calling, would you be open to that, or are you gonna try to stay independent? You kind of. I got a lawyer. Oh, <laughs> smart I man. A, a man is smart. He said, "Look, I gotta get the paperwork right. I need a lawyer." I'm not, I see, I'm not money, money, money hungry. For, uh -huh. Like to just take a deal now. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to. You trying to structure it right? Yeah, you want to make sure that everything is in all the eyes are dotted, t's are crossed, so to speak. Right. Got you, got you, got you. Sure. So, um, tell me about this upcoming project you've got. What would you say is your favorite song on the project? My favorite song in the project would be Heart to Heart because I wrote that because I had just had, I had surgery and they said like I said I didn't know that I was like sick but I, when I went to the doctor I won't call the uh, ambulance I was in the ambulance went to the doctor they said if you didn't come here you would have died the next day so boom I'm in there after I get my surgery I asked the uh, the lady that's in there can she give me like a paper and a pen I don't know why I didn't write it on my phone but 
I said, I just want to write it on paper. I wrote the song when I was in the hospital, mm. literally. Mm. So I feel, because I, I feel every lyric in that song. Like, mm. That song that does numbers. That's deep. Yeah. So, so basically, you had something that, that could have taken you out of here yeah. at an early yeah. age. Because you're a young dude. Last year. Wow. Yeah. So ba basically, um, cheating death and being here, um, what has that done for your grind? Do you feel like it's a, it, it amplified your hustle and your desire because you could have not made it? It makes me appreciate every little single thing. Mm. That's mm. happening. Like That's food. Talking to friends, all that, yeah. playing the game, just getting around. Getting, getting real nice haircuts. Your haircut yeah. is fly right now, by the way. No, yeah. no funny stuff. Like yo, your barber is. Shout a, out to Kenny the he's, barber. He's a magician. Like I'm looking at the back and the sides. I'm like that fade is epic. So anyway, um, I'm glad you made it. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you got an amazing testimony. Um, what would you, you know, for for other folks that are walking in your shoes that are looking at life right now, thinking, you know, I don't want to be a musician. I want to be an artist. I want to. You know, because you seem to have a real passion for the creative process, not just the lifestyle and all the glamorous stuff, but really, I like to write, I like to be in the booth, I like to hit this music before I've even done anything to it. You know, you sound like a true artisan. Um, what would you say to someone like you um, that might be on that cusp or that threshold trying to decide if this is what they want to do or not? I would say, just do it. Like, block out all the noise. People are going to tell you not to do it. I didn't hear that. I heard that a hundred million times, but just do it. And just chase your dreams, follow what you believe in. Okay. Don't try to copy nobody's sound. Just be yourself because you copy copying somebody else's sound not gonna get you far in the music game. Everybody sound the same. Label's not looking for that. Just tell stories about your life, man. Just try to make it hit. So 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 be honest with them about yeah. who you are as an artist. Definitely. So um, lastly, um, what would you if, if if I'm listening to this and watching this interview? And I'm not familiar with you, and I, I, I'm intrigued now. If you could describe it, what would I expect tuning into you if I was to search you online and find your music on one of the amazing platforms that I'm sure you're on all of? What, what What's in it for me as a listener? What am I going to get out of listening to Fat Trey? Man, if y'all want to listen to some playthrough music, no skips, instant classics, something you can play at the cookout, around your girl, be sentimental, all that stuff. Fat Trey. Okay. Don't connect okay. To okay. That's what's up. Well, Fat Trey, I appreciate you spending time with us today. I'm quite sure our family out here at Who's Next 757 love to see you here. They're going to support you. They're going to tap in. Um, you know, if y'all want the rest of this interview, click the link in the bio for more. Um, and then, by the way, do me a favor. In the comment section below, y'all tap in and say who's a better interviewer. Camlo or me, I hero Kurt at I hero Kurt, okay? And if you want me back more often, put it in the put it in the bottom and we're gonna make sure we talk to the big wigs at top to get me a, a permanent position here. Stay tuned for more. This is who's next 757. We out.